Okay, okay, all right, all right, all right. So let me get this straight. Um, let me get this straight. So, Flemeth has been like having this spirit in her, which is why she's having all these like witchly powers. Like that, that's why she's been like that throughout all the games because she has those powers and shit. That, that's what I'm getting at, at least. And now she just stole Kieran's, uh, old god powers from the uh arts demon okay i think i understand somewhat let's talk to her about that i guess be very pleased and now she Hell also has the ability of me too of the inquisition at her personal beck and call great i feel certain what happened at the temple of methal must somehow have been her influence that's possible you might be right was a temple dedicated to her after all is it a coincidence we ended up there there must be a connection we cannot see i suppose we have little choice but to proceed and be thankful she assisted us at all do you know anything about elven lore yes, you know a great deal about elven lore the dalish are not the only ones interested in the distant past inquisitor indeed my skills allow me access to places the dalish dare not even dream of the ancient elves hold secrets they have not yet given up. Secrets about the foundation of Thedas itself. Thus, hmm. they are my focus. Corypheus clearly feels the same. Hmm. Flemeth tell the truth. Do you trust what Flemeth told us? About what she is? I... I am uncertain. I knew there was more to her than I realized that she was not truly human. This... Hmm. I once found her grimoire, and that was where I learned her immortality was gained by stealing the bodies of her daughters. Flemeth claims I misunderstood. It is not forced on the unwilling. Meaning I might agree to such a thing? <laughs> Impossible, yet there seemed an undeniable sense of truth to the things she told us. All my years spent hunting for arcane mysteries, and the greatest was the one I left behind. Hmm. What will you do now? So what do you intend to do now? Now? I will move on. You have what you need to face Corypheus. Where I will go is uncertain. I must consider the fact that Flemeth may yet have plans for me. You are her servant. But I am her daughter. Hmm. I doubt she will let me slip completely from her clutches. Whatever happens, I wish you well in the coming battle, Inquisitor. Tell me more about you. I'd like to know more about you. Or I've already asked this question. Then ask. Yeah, I already asked these questions. The okay. Until next time. Then. <laughs> I leave you to the garden, <laughs> he said. <laughs> Who's this? Breaker Throng? Inquisitor. Oh, okay. Now the specialists are just hanging around, I guess. Um, huh. Quite strange. Oh, there's more already here? Ooh. There's more stuff's here already. Nice. Oh, wait, didn't I get new seeds of Prophet Laurel seeds or whatever? I want to plant those. Let's see. Where, where was it? Some rares, isn't it? Yeah, I need these. I need these. Yeah. All right. Start making those for me. Prophet Laurel. Yeah, I need those. Okay. Mm, keep doing that. Need profit laurels, so I'll plant another one of these. Three of them. There we go. Alright, so I guess we should talk to every. Oh, who's this? This is not Michelle guy. That we recruited, right? Yeah. Huh. Go to the altar of Mathal. The final piece. Oh my god. Uh. Uh. I know that's not loading. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Uh, let's talk to Varric about what just happened and shit. So, I'm still trying to wrap my mind around that. Yeah, I am too, bro. You went to an ancient rune where you consumed a pool of elven... elfiness, and then walked through a mirror, and wound up back here. Have I mentioned that the shit that happens to you is crazy? I uh -huh. don't think about this anymore. You want to discuss something 
normal? Mm-hmm. Corypheus, uh -huh. can I have a personal question? Can I ask you something? I don't think I can ask him any other questions, can I? Me? I'm flattered. Also inclined toward extravagant lies. Yeah, I don't have anything else to say. For him, alright. Thanks, Varric. No problem. Hmm. Talk to Solus about what happened. I think I probably should have brought him. He would have been pretty useful for this. I would imagine. Drinking tea? He's probably shocked about what he heard. He's like, what the hell? About what happened. I would be. Something wrong with your tea? It is tea. I detest this stuff. But this morning, I need to shake the dreams from my mind. I may also need a favor. Name it. You just have to ask. One of my oldest friends has been captured by mages. Forced Whoa. into slavery. I heard the cry for help as I slept. Oh, how did you hear the cry? When your friend was captured, how did he... She... It. It? It? My friend is a spirit of wisdom. Hmm. Unlike the spirits clamoring to enter our world through the rifts, it was dwelling quite happily in the Fade. It was summoned against its will, and wants my help to gain its freedom and return to the Fade. Hmm. Why didn't it want in? I thought spirits wanted to find their way into this world. Some do, certainly. Just as many Orlesian peasants wish they could journey to exotic Ravain. But not everyone wants to go to Ravain. My friend is an explorer, seeking lost wisdom and reflecting it. Huh. It would happily discuss philosophy with you, but it had no wish to come here physically. Why would they summon it? Do you have any idea what the mages want with your friend? Wait, wait, no. what mages? Wait a minute. He knows a great deal of lore and history. What the mages? The mage rebellion is over. In the fade. It is <laughs> Isn't it? They seek information it does not wish to It give. should be over, I think. They intend to torture it. Huh, I'll help. All right. Let's go get your friend. Thank you. I got a sense of my friend's location before I awoke. I'll mark it on our map. Huh. What the heck? Find the spirit of Solus in the Exalted Plains. Okay. I All wish right. I had been with you at the Temple of Methal. I could have warned you. Oh man, I warned wish me. I brought you. Yeah, you I do wish I brought the you. Service of an ancient elven god. I know. I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't bring you. You have been perfect for this. Th shit, man. Oh, meaning? What does that mean exactly? You are Mithal's creature now. Everything you do, whether you know it or not, will be for her. You have given up a part of yourself. Uh, why does this bother you? You don't even believe in the ancient elven gods. I don't believe they were gods, no, but, but I believe that they existed. Something existed to start the legends. If not gods, then mages. Or spirits, or something we've never seen. And you are bound to one of them now. I suppose it is better you have the power than Corypheus. Which leads to the next logical question. What will you do with the power of the well once Corypheus is dead? I'll rely on those I trust one thing at a time. I'll make the world better. I'll rely... Uh... Sure was. I rely on those I trust. I'm not arrogant enough to think it's my decision alone. Whatever happens, we'll do it together. You think to share your power. To avoid the temptation to misuse it. A noble sentiment, but ultimately a mistake. Hmm. Why? Because while one selfless man may walk away from the lure of power's corruption... Another will come no to it. ...has ever done so. Huh. We will. I trust my friends. We'll try. <laughs> well enough to carve the angles of her face from memory. Why is this so important to you? You have not been what I expected, Inquisitor. You have impressed me. You must not let false modesty allow you to pass your power to someone else. There are few regrets sharper than watching fools squander what you sacrificed to achieve. Forgive my melancholy. Corypheus has cost us much. The Temple of Methal did not deserve such a fate. The orb he carries, and its stolen power. That, at least, we may still recover. With luck, some of the past may yet survive. Sounds like you're leaving or something. No, thank you for everything. Thank you, Solas. We couldn't have done this without you. You are welcome. Hmm. Alright, anything else? Good afternoon. 
Well, don't tell me about your journeys. All right. We'll talk later. Goodbye. Hmm. So everyone has something to say about my thing. Yeah, I should have brought Solus though. I do. I do wish I can go back and bring him. That would have been interesting. Oh, what don't tell me you're reading that crap <laughs> again. I should uh, high back. town or whatever. To Tavinta. Once this is done, if we're still alive, all my talk of how terribly wrong things are back home. But what do I do about it? Nothing. Hmm. I brought this on. How does this relate to the Elven Temple? That elf, Abelas. He said the Imperium wasn't what destroyed the Elves. My people would never accept that. It would reduce us to scavengers, destroy our legacy no matter how terrible. But we should accept it. Take our history down a peg. Confront the legacy hanging over us like a shroud. Maybe not all of us want to, but that could be altered. If you can change minds, so can I. Came here to help. You, oh, you could do great things. He could. Someone with your impeccable taste could transform to Vinter. He could do I some good things. Right. You usually are. It might surprise you to know that you're the one who inspired me. You're shaping the world for good or ill. How could I aspire to do any less? If it means proving that to Vinter can be better, that there's hope even for my homeland, I would do anything. Hmm. All right. Anything else? You know we're actually related, Inquisitor. Related? What? Oh, not first cousins or anything like that. Can you imagine? You're a Trevelyan, however, and somewhere in dank nethers of my family tree, there was also a Trevelyan. Perhaps he was even the one who ventured to Ostwick to establish the branch. What the hell? <laughs> you look up this shit? Can we still flirt? Uh, no. How do you even know that? You know that off the top of your head? Maybe the lower middle thereabouts. Bloodlines are serious business in Tevinter. You're taught lessons and tested by strict nannies. <laughs> strict I nannies? I family mentioned, and I had to go through all the old mnemonics, but yes, there it is. Huh, that's I interesting. there was a reason we looked so much alike. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you guys don't look that much alike, I'm just going to say. Uh, good to know. Learn something new every day. Nice, isn't it? It's like being at a quality library, provided you're not the one stocking the shelves. We should talk, begin a romance? No. Huh. Alright. I should go. Naturally. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, it's turning into any research things we have. I don't think we have that much, but might as well. Not sure. Eh, had a little bit. Not that much. Alright, can I talk to Liliana about anything? About what happened? All the shit that just happened with us? Seriously? I was pondering who might be divine. And it suddenly occurred to me. Is it so ridiculous for the Grand Clerics to support me? Why shouldn't they? Support her? Really? What would you do as divine? If you were divine, what would you do? Change things. Change everything. Your support of the Mage Rebellion was a good start. We must build on this. No more circles. The Mages will be free. The huh. Chantry will accept them as the Maker's children. Hmm. In fact, it will accept everyone. Elves, Dwarves, even Canari. Why exclude them? That's good the ideas. Allows our differences to Both her and Cassandra have, have good ideas. How we are the same. Uh... I don't really know. I don't know. I support. I would support both of them as the new divine, to be honest. Her ideas seem good, but freeing the circles, because I do kind of agree that the mages should have be in like they should go to some place to have special training, or else there's going to be all this other shit, you know, going on. You know what I mean? There'd be all kinds of stuff going on, and like they'd have magic all of a sudden, and bad stuff. like that mansion that we went to. You know what I mean? There'd be more cases of that happening and all this shit. At the same time, they wouldn't be afraid, though. That's another thing. 